Alright guys, we're heading to a little pond right now. We're going to test out this monster bass box. We're going to use all the baits that come in it, try and catch a fish on each one of them. Um, see what works the best. Well, we'll catch you guys at the pond. I'm pretty sure that every time that I try to go fishing in a pond that it looks like it's going to rain. Check this out. Look at that. I'm going to get absolutely drenched. Alright guys, so we're here. Uh, this wind is going to be bad, I can already tell. You can take a look at this tree. Audio is probably not going to be the greatest. I'll do what I can, but you guys stay tuned. Alright guys, well the first bait we're going to start off with is this crankbait. We'll see what we can get on it, and uh, let's go. Alright guys, I know this audio is going to be terrible, so I apologize ahead of time, but... I'll talk as much as I can on the big camera with the windscreen, so let's go. Got a follow right there. First cast, first follow. There we go. There we go, I got one. Stay down, stay down. Oh. Come on. First fish on the crankbait. Feels pretty good. Oh, he's in these weeds. There we go. Oh, that's a pretty good bass. Maybe a pound, pound and a half. All right, buddy, thank you. Time to switch baits. All right, guys, well, we got the first fish on the crankbait. We're gonna switch over to the jerk bait now and try and knock that one out so let's go all right guys i'm gonna stay in the same spot i'm gonna throw out this jerk bait let's see if we can get one in that same spot there we go two baits down look at this this ain't a bad one. Oh no! I lost him! No! <laughs> Alright guys, so I did catch one fish on that jerk bait. I know that I missed it at the bank. I'm just showing that these baits catch fish. So we're going to move on to the Ned Rig. I do have a Ned Rig lead head. Uh, we're going to throw that on. It didn't come with the box, but we're going to test these baits out. Alright guys, let's give this old Ned Rig a shot. There we go. <laughs> Not a big one at all, but that's a Ned Rig fish. That's the third bait. I'm surprised that guy even ate it. <laughs> that Ned Rig is about the same size as him. <laughs> all right, buddy. All right, guys, so we ended up getting one on the Ned Rig. We're going to jump in and use this jig now uh, see if we can find something bigger out here so let's get at it there we go not a huge fish but that's another bait that we knocked out so this is how I had that rigged up it's a little craw trailer on the back it's that little flipping hook well, another bait down. So we got one on the peanut butter and jelly flipping jig. Now we're gonna move on to the tube. I think I'm gonna Texas rig that and just put it on the same rod I was throwing. So let's see if we can get another one. There we go. There we go. Get out of the wind here. So. Finally got that tube fish. These fish are not as big as I remember them being in here. But nonetheless, that's a fish. All right, well, let's get this guy back. Let's throw on the next bait. See you, buddy. All right, guys, so now we're done with the coffee tube. We're gonna jump to our last soft plastic, which is that really, really big worm. Yum baits. 
So let's throw this on, and then we've only got top water after that, and we've got the whole box, so let's get at it. Oh my god. Whatever that was broke me off. So I just got broken off by something big in here. We're gonna get back out there and uh, I gotta see what that was. If not, I gotta go somewhere else and try and find something like that because that about ripped a rod right out of my hand. So it's an interesting place. All right, I had to wait to get back here. It got a little too dark. Uh, we ended up fishing all the way till sundown. We caught fish on every bait except two. And one of those being that worm where you guys saw that I got broke off by something big. And the last bait was that black and blue topwater monster bass popper. And we were getting hit on that. I got four or five hits on that before I had to head out. So I would say overall is a very successful outing, especially getting to try out this monster bass box and everything that comes in it. So uh, if you guys like this video, make sure that you give it a thumbs up. If you guys aren't subscribed, please subscribe. Check out Monster Bass. Get yourself a box. Use the code SAVE10. My link is in the description below. Uh, you guys can go there and pick one up. So uh, thanks for watching, guys. Catch you on the next one.